welcome back dear friends inside this class we are going to discuss about flex grow and flex shrink so this is the topic open the code editor and i have just put the width of the element 200 pixel and the height of this element is 100 pixel also so the all these all are the basic settings you can see the coding here and finally this is the output of this coding you can see 100 pixel by 100 pixel are the width and heights so now i can just add here uh, inside this child element here child if flex dash grow and just set the value to one first i'm going to tell you what will uh, flex grow will do flex grow will cover and divide the extra space between the element so what does it mean so you can see on the right side we have a lot of extra space so if you are applying flex grow so this will cover all this extra space and it will divide the space on these elements so let's save this Control s and come here now you can see we don't have any extra space here and the space are covered by dividing to these elements so you can just use uh, copy this Control c and we have just some extra class here like one two three four and you can see one two three four i want to just apply this on the two and just set the value three so now you can see these elements are is bigger three times bigger than other elements so you have just told here flex grow on the class number two that this box should be bigger three times bigger than other elements four time five time or two time you can just set any size you want you can just set here now it is two time bigger if you want so you can use four time you can save and refresh now it is four time bigger so let's just put this on two time and save so this is the usage of flex grow so once again i'm going to tell you it will cover and divide the extra space between the element and if you are adding inside a separate class so you can just increase the size of any elements just like this two time bigger three time bigger you can just apply this here so you can just apply this uh, here you can copy and paste so let's just put this four time bigger save and refresh now it's four time bigger and it is two time bigger so like this you can just uh, use flex grow so let's just talk about flex sharing so for working on flex sharing you need to put this the width of this to 250 pixel you need to increase the width and remove this flex wrap and flex direction i'm going to cut this Control x and you can just uh, remove this one also and this one or this one you can just remove let's just add flex shrink so four time or two time you can just set now you can save and refresh so you can see there is no changes but when you want to just minimize this web page so you can see from the start just focus on this box number three so here you can see it will uh, reduce the size of this element two times smaller than others you can see this one is smaller than these all four so I hope you are understand what is flex grow and what is flex shrink. So have a nice time and see you.